and also you guys we are more than 100 subscribers yay hi guys welcome to tilt the nations my name is Gunne Kumpo and on this channel I'm sharing my life and my journey and the things that I've learned and I'm hoping that you guys will be one or two things that will inspire you to go turn the world around you the right side up. So in today's video, guys, I've been very excited about this video. We are talking about goal setting and vision goals. Yay! The 2020s here and I'm very, very excited about this year and I'm sure that you guys are. And I decided that I was going to do my vision boards and set the goals and show you guys what that looks like, right? So before we do the vision boards, you have to first of all set goals. And how do you set goals? You will start with having a vision. So the most important part of a vision board actually is a vision. See, 2020 is not the year for New Year resolutions or, you know, just things off in your head like that. No. You need a vision. And not just a vision, a compelling vision. So what is a compelling vision? I'm glad you asked. A compelling vision is basically your ability to see. Like, it's, it's being able to just in your in your mind be able to just see the massive potential that is actually residing in you see a compelling vision is not uh gucci gucci bags or i don't know balenciagas or human hair or just a car or you know those things that we want but they're just needs they are not really a vision and if you want to really set a really good like make a good vision board and set goals that are you know achievable for you in 2020 i think that you don't just need you know very flimsy things that you legit i agree you need but it's not a vision you know what i mean right a compelling vision is powerful it is something inspiring something that is captivating that will just push you like it's bigger than just really uh, needs and all of that it's, it's something that we, that you can if you're able to just see within you and just if god is actually able to open your eyes to just see something that you will start to work towards guys see i'm sure you have come across one or two people that are visionary like it is the most beautiful thing it's just I don't even know the words. It's sexy. It's just nice to to be able to see someone, a young girl especially, or a young guy that has a vision in their face and they are pursuing it, just focused on it. I mean, you can't you can't buy that. And that's what I'm encouraging you guys for in this 2020. Before you actually start to set your goals and see, uh, this year I'm going to lose weight. This year, I'm going to run. This year, I'm going to make money. This year, don't do not do that. I, I want you to, first of all, look within yourself and, like, ask God. Because the honest truth is that it's actually God that can be able to, that, that gives visions. Like, just like he did for Abraham in, if you read Genesis 13, the, the, it's God that is the one that, will be able to enlarge your mind, enlarge your capacity, and, and just be able to see, open your eyes to be able to see what you are capable of. And when he was walking Abraham through that, and just telling him that he should look at the stars, that is God actually helping him to see a vision, right? So I don't know if you, you have any vision. I don't know how, where you are at in your life right now, but I'm going to encourage you, you can pause this video here, or maybe at the end of this video, you can just really in your own personal, like private time, just ask God to give you a vision. 
ask God to open your eyes. Ask him to give you the capacity to think, to see, to look within you. Because it's not even about the things that you're seeing other people do. No, it's about looking inside of you and just being able to see. Being able to imagine one of the greatest gifts that God has given us is imagination. The things that are that are within you, it's 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 unique to you. It's not how you how you see life, how you how you see things, the things that you want to do, the things that fascinate you. It's very different from the things that fascinate me. And that's because of the way God has wired you, the way God has shaped you, the way the purpose of God for your life so i'm not asking you to go and look around and see oh my friend is doing this that's going to be my vision that's why i asked i said that you can just take your time ask god to open your eyes to look within and awaken the things that he has already put inside of you and by the grace of god i know i know my father He's very faithful. He will answer you. You just need to come to him and, and be willing to hear what he has to say. There's this quote by Carl Jung. I think he says that who looks outside dreams, but who looks inside awakens. So honey, it's time to look within you. It's time to look inside your heart. Okay? Now, if you want to learn more about vision and all these things i would recommend sin the dream uh miles munro and of course my biggest mentor ddk double did Kurumi. there's actually this webinar that she did that she it was about compelling vision. so i would i think i will leave the link to that in my description box below you should really watch that it was so powerful and it was just uh it was where I actually really understood because these are things that have been boiling inside of me, but I, I didn't really get it until actually learning and reading and seeing and watching all these different things about vision. I actually was able to understand what I need with regards to vision, right? So I would leave the link in the description box. You should definitely check it out. See, the things that I recommend you guys, please. Try and just look at them because they will help you. See, my goal with this channel more than anything is that I want to see more and more young people, young girls, young guys just get better and move forward with their lives and, and not waste a lot of time living anyhow. Especially if you're a Christian because you have the power of God. You have the resources of heaven available to you for you to tap into and just you know take advantage of so i'm sharing these things to inspire you to motivate you to move you to just do the best and live the best that you can live live your live your best life in 2020 you get what i mean right okay so now that you have a vision the next thing that you need to do is to set goals around your vision the things that you want to achieve right the next thing that you need to do is to set goals and not just for the things that are visionary in life but a balanced human being should be able to set goals around different aspects of their life and there are at least seven i would say six to seven areas of your life that you should be setting goals around right i would say your spirituality regardless of your religion you should have goals around your spirituality your finances your friendships and relationships your health and fitness your career your business your the things that help you make money your marriage if you're married or if you're engaged your fiance yeah, like you should have goals for your spouse or your partner. And yeah, I think that covers it, right? So you should have goals. You should sit down with yourself. That reminds me, if you watched my 
video about taking a uh, stock of your 2019. I think this will actually help because in that video, I really encourage people to just sit down and reflect on their year. You should check out that video. I'll leave the link around here. That if you are, if you were able to do like take a stock of your year, right? You would see different parts of your life and the things that are required in these different parts. And then you can begin to set goals in all these different parts of your life. You should sit down with yourself and ask, how am I going to move my life forward with regards to my spirituality? How do I get closer to God? What do I need to do? What resources do I need to use and all of that? Who do I need to get close to? Uh, do I need accountability partners? You know, stuff like that. When it comes to money and your finances, you should set goals. How much money do I want to make? It's not just, I'm going to make money this year. I'm going to blow. No. Actually have specific, measurable, articulate, realistic, and time-bound goals, right? Smart goals. You should be able to set this around these different areas of life. And not just setting goals, you would actually start to break down these goals and set smaller goals within the larger framework of the goals that you're setting, right? So after you do this in the different areas of, of your life, you know, you know, you know what the Bible says. Write the vision, make it plain, so that you can run and run fast. 2020 is the year that you need a fresh journal. I mean, you have started a new decade. You need to write. What are the things that are playing in your heart? What are the things that you want to achieve? Take that journal, take that pen, start writing it out. Now, after you've written these goals and the smaller goals out, you need to write it down in pictures because pictures are just powerful images you know so and that is where a vision board comes in now this is the first part of this video i really wanted to lay the foundation and i'm excited because instead of talking too much i'm just going to show you guys what my own vision board looks like in the next video so please please stay tuned i'm going to release that video very soon don't forget to just share this video with someone that you think needs it. Young people around you, your friends, your family, your relations. Just share this video and encourage them because you love them and you care for them and you want them to have a beautiful life, right? And also, you guys, we are more than 100 subscribers. Yay! Thank you so much to everyone that has been sharing, commenting, liking my videos i really really appreciate you guys like thank you so much that i appreciate that you find what i have to say useful and valuable and that is my goal to give you guys much as much value as i have been able to you know acquire in my life and all the things that has helped me i am really 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 willing to just share so thank you and keep doing that. Keep subscribing. No, you only subscribe once. <laughs> I mean, keep commenting, keep sharing, keep uh, liking this video. Tell someone to come and join the family, the Tilt the Nation family, because I have so much, like honestly, so much for you guys in 2020. And I'm really excited about that. So... I'm going to be having my first giveaway uh, in the next video. So you guys stay tuned for that, okay? I would give all the details about that in my next video. So I have a question. This is a question for those that watched up until this time. I would know. Guys, let me know in the comment section. What is your vision? What is your vision for 2020? Can you share with me? I would really, really love to know. And out of everything that I shared, can you tell me what stood out for you? What was your epiphany? <laughs> or something that you just you know, never knew. And now you know, right? So just let me know in the comment section below. I would really, really appreciate that. 
I reply all my comments because I really want to engage with you guys and you know grow with everyone I hope you enjoyed this video thank you so much for watching don't forget to like share subscribe to my channel and I will see you guys in my next video Mwah.